small When you give back Much in abundance is returned to you I can see this being a national camp in two years yeah. It's the cross of the league with dirty compete Whatever you do, you guys have to give your all It's the best in the state, meet at Rainer Beach Come work on your game, work on your range okay. The harder you train, the brighter your name If ball is life, I heard you straight I heard you nice, come show and prove Pull out the moves, that jumper so smooth Wet like a pool, her work is the tool That lead to success, who's really the best, yeah Hazies and J's, all three days Get back on D, don't give nothing for free PG lead the break, Euro with them shakes Got them all on skates, shooters on wings Got three for the team, NBA dream start with the little things Are you unique, got a D1 physique It's the Jermon Crawford camp, are you elite? Best of the best, who said it impressed? To make a highlight, can you pass the test? Spit the pick and roll, hit the give and go Hit them with the juice, catch the alley use. We need the truth, stake your claim Crawford camp elite, get better every game Perfect your skills with them player drills Non-contest, get the whole Proud or thrill, handle the pill. How does it feel? We'll recognize real. What do I lay? Kicking that knowledge, help get kids to college. We giving it back so the future is stacked. Are you giving back from effort every day? J crossover, learn from the master. What up, mom? When you put in work, rewards come faster. Come sit and learn the game and film study. Big shout out to D, Huddy. Cause you always kept it real, buddy. Social investment pay dividends. Show kids potential is unlimited. You give back to the youth. I gave back from the booth. You changing their world through every boy and girl. These memories gonna last a lifetime. Cry for the leap. You know how hard to play this game and you're not tough, you're not gonna last. Not too many guys that are here all day with you guys. Where did I say we're always get you going? The whistle. If they one clap, you give me one. If I say two, you give me two, real easy, right? Two claps. Two claps. Two claps. Good. Let's spread all the way down. Hustle. All the way down. All the way down. Use the whole court. Use the whole court. Good. Quickly. Good. Now, eyes. One clap. Fill in behind somebody facing me. Quickly. Good. One clap. Two claps. One more time. Eyes. Fill in behind somebody, so it should be two, one and two. Let's have a lot of energy. Get ten lines of four, quickly. The whistle will always get you going. Are we clear? Yeah. That's a question. Are we clear? Yeah. First thing we're going to do, forward lunges with our hands above our head. We're going to do a dynamic warm-up, meaning control the movement. Reinforcement, positive energy is contagious. Go. Eyes, when I say eyes, it's an attention grabber, meaning I want your eyes. It pretty much means drop what you're doing, pay attention to what's going on, and uh, let's focus. All the way down and back. Behind the line, meaning behind the line. Ready? Get there, get there, get there. Get there. Shout out Nate, shout out Seattle, Tacoma, everybody that's came and supported. Breathe in, breathe in, everybody breathe. One, two, three. Driver, stay stand. You're in a stand. Get in. Red pan below the knees. Ready, go. These guys, Nate Robinson, Jamal, these guys are really giving back to the blue, really here, really involved, really touching these kids, giving them a lot of good knowledge. Hands on top of the ball. The focus is just kind of getting them on track to be able to learn basketball etiquette, be disciplined, learn what it takes to work out, and try to you know, you know strive to where they can be the next players in this top kit. They want there's a lot of talent in the gym. Yeah. Low tap. I want the ball as low as you can. Now's the time to go hard. You'll switch to distraction the ball here. Good base. Good. Be quick. Be quick. Shout out Ali Wet for Duxon. And we are here at my home court, Jamal Crawford Court, Random Beach Vikings. Jamal Crawford is going to be in between the knees. Go, go, go. 
This camp is special because it's about everybody else. It's about every age group, first to fourth grade, and fifth to eighth grade, to the high schoolers. Uh, it's about just giving back. It really is. Basketball is one thing, but I think being a better person is way more important. Okay, eyes up. Here's our next one. Taking the mindset to you know teach the whole game, not just basketball skill, not offense, defense, but mindset as well, which I think is very important. It's can you score in a system? There's a lot of kids here that can score one on one ISO and do their thing. There's a lot of horrible shots, but can you score in a system? The whole point of this whole thing was not just to see who was the nicest. It's not just to go out there and run five on five and get up and down. We can play pick up anyway. It's hopefully to help make the transition to college a lot easier. Because when you guys get there, even now there's less than ten guys in the league who can just dribble when they want to. Like you got to make quick decisions. You got three seconds, basically, and two or three dribbles. So you got, if you ain't got a shot, I got to drive, I got to kick it. So if you're here, like you said, going through the motions, and you're just shooting a shot, not following through. Every time you shoot, you're doing this, or you're not following through. That's gonna be your game for the rest of your life. Happens because as you guys mature in life, it gets harder and harder and harder, and just people just weed themselves out. If you watch me and Jamal shoot the ball, it will be the same way every single time. It took a lot of work to get there. I was the same kid trying to learn how to shoot. I was learning. I wanted to learn how to shoot. That was the only thing I didn't have as a jumper when I was young. I could play defense, run, play hard the whole game, not get tired, had handles. And that's what we're here to educate them on, just about, not just with basketball and working hard and fundamentals and, you know, cool stuff like that, but just to be, you know, good kids, good, uh, you know, being you know, good to your teammate, to the person that's next to you, and to pay it forward by giving back to your community. And so hopefully, hopefully one day, when they get older, they'll be doing the same thing that we're doing, and uh, that'll be their job of paying it forward. And I learned how to be a great shooter by just over and over, repetition, repetition, following through. Jamal Crawford's top 30 elite, first time ever in the history of Washington State with this been done. This is special because you guys are the first group. We have some of the top kids in our state in the camp, you know. We've talked about how we can expand this camp, and obviously we want to give our kids in the state the best experience. Next year will be the whole Northwest, and the year after that will be the whole country. And eventually, you know, it'll be a nationwide thing. It'll be the top 100 in the country. He's a visionary. We talk all the time just about different ideas and the, uh, the, the way we can affect change off the court all the time. He's had national players reach out to him, and so we see this in the next two, three years becoming a national camp where we can invite the top 40 kids in our country here to compete in Seattle and, and give them everything from skill development, from offensive IQ, defensive IQ, classroom film session. We're gonna watch film today. It's all about them going to the next level, seeing how it'll be when they go to college. It won't be a shock when they go there. You know, they've been taught some of these things and that's what it's all about. You see all these other camps, this is gonna be second to none. I remember being you guys in shoes. Like, no lie, being in high school just dreaming. You know what I mean, dreaming about playing Division One, dreaming about going to the NBA. And I wish I knew then what I know now. And it's our job to give you guys all that. Uh, we've had nutritionists come in. To help kids learn how to become healthy, what foods to eat. You know, and so he's just done a good job to kind of give. He's played 18 years in the league. So to be able to give the tips that have you know, allowed him to play that long, I think it's important that these kids are getting that at a young age, 15, 16 years old, to be able to take with them to their college career and possibly pro career. Set a goal or two. Do right by yourself. I'm telling you, it's so, so important. Health is wealth, I promise you guys. You gotta be available, you gotta be on the court. You wanna feel your best, you wanna have more energy. Basketball is just like in the country. Now it's a world again. You got people in China, you got people in Africa, you got people in Europe. They're good players all over the place. So put the work in. If you guys really want it, whatever you do in life, put the work in. Give yourself the best chance to make it. There's not too many guys in the NBA. Marvin's gonna be a Hall of Famer one day, guys. Believe it. Trust me, listen. He's gonna be a Hall of Famer. There's not too many guys that are here all day with you guys. Like, how cool is it you guys get to hang and be with him all day? He don't have to be here. He can have, I, 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 I didn't been to seeing different camp guys come in, say what's up, and leave. 
He's here with you guys. Just to be great at anything you do. Nate didn't just play basketball, he played football. He ran track. Now he's in this community giving back. That's what it's about. But you guys, whatever you do, you guys have to give your all to it. Or else you're just cheating yourself. My advice to you guys, like you said, is to grind, hard workers, great listeners. You gotta be able to listen. You gotta be able to know plays. You gotta know where everybody is on the court. Not just being a point guard. Everybody should know. Whatever position you're at. You should know the point guard all the way up to the center. Who's to say you can't be the number one pick in the WNBA draft? Who says that? No, why? So somebody in here can't be the number one pick in the NBA draft. You should believe it. You should want to be. Because I was a kid. I knew I was making it to the league. I already knew when I was 10 years old. I told my mom, I'm going to either bat NFL or NBA. I promise you. I was just hungry for it. It's the only thing I can think of as a kid. I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm grinding. I'm, I'm making it. Y'all got to want it, though. Y'all got to be hungry for it. Hey, I told you. You come back with a dunk. Like you said, eager to want to win, to want to compete. Like, your dreams should scare you. Like, the greatest gift that I've ever gave or received is to know that kids come up to me and tell me, man, you're, you're an inspiration. You guys have imagine, I'm five foot nothing. I wasn't supposed to make it out of Rainier Beach. Y'all don't get that? Y'all gotta understand, they told me I couldn't do a lot of things. Everybody has got to think big picture, but still take it one day at a time. Like, we got to think about not just now, like, hey, I got a handle, I want to show it off. I'm not saying don't do that, but whatever it is, make it quick. Make it good, clean basketball. It's better to play that way. The drills that we've done during camp, I mean, obviously, we're working on all type of skill development, from ball handling to passing to footwork to scoring. We've even taken an emphasis on defense. We're teaching these kids how to play basketball, not just be an offensive player. Two ways you can get him the ball without directly passing it to him. We've talked about toughness. Skill is important. If you don't have heart to play this game and you're not tough, you're not going to last, okay? Not a lot of camps where you see a loose ball drill. It is what it is. Washington is doing things. Trust. I want you guys to get on the floor. Show me how tough you are. Show me how tough you are. We're going to state championship here. Man, what school you going to? I'm to go to Fox. You got to go to Get on the floor next year for loose ball, you're playing freshman ball. I coach it, ball. And this is why we won a state championship. Get up, is going so high, that's when you when you get levels, you go to college in the NBA, you gotta learn to slow down. The, the best time is when you got, like, nah, I'm cool, I'm cool. That's what made B-Roy so cold, that's what made Harden so cold. They go at their own pace. The best players in the world are playing like they're in high school. Like, nah, I don't wanna go yet, I'm cool. But so dive, use the motion to get the ball, but once you get it, don't be in a rush. That kind of stuff you gotta be ready to do. All right, gotta love it, gotta love taking that intensity on the defensive end and take personal pride in you. All right, it's personal. He's not getting a bucket on me, he's not. All right, that's how you have to play the game. I work on three, one, two, three, four. Jab, cross, step. Jab, cross, step. Nice and low, here, finish there. You shoot from one spot, you rotate to your right. Does everybody know where your right is? Yeah. Ball should come off, these two fingers last. Straight to the rim. Talk with the kids, uh, to work out in front of the kids so they can see 
for themselves how hard that you have to actually, you know, go and work to actually be successful, not just in sports alone, but just in everything you do in life. Uh, being here with, you know, for Jamal, being a speaker, but just being here, interacting with the kids has been uh, phenomenal for me, feeling to give back to the community. That's what they're doing. Uh, kids have brought uh, shoes, you know, to uh, shoes that they've had at home uh, to give back to, you know, other kids that don't have shoes. And I think that's a, you know, that's a great, a great step for them to teach them how to pay something forward. They didn't have to pay, obviously, and, and normally this is a, a $375, $400 camp. But your entry fee was just donating a shoe for somebody else. Somebody can, can use it more than you can. Uh, it's about taking care of each other, taking care of our community. And I thought that was the point of if everybody's giving something. And that's what kind of you know makes our community special. We supply fully stocked backpacks. The boys get haircuts. The girls get their nails done. Uh, so they go to school feeling good. You know, I think it lifts a burden off the parents. You know, they're fully stocked. They don't have to do anything. When you go to school and you have a fresh haircut and you got all your school supplies, you feel better. You have more confidence. You want to be in class. And hopefully we can encourage that and promote that. I think everybody wins. I got this thing on my mind. I'm being great. Yeah. So it's all me. I caught threes for the whole team. Now we at the top. MJ, 88, 9, now we're gonna stop. Yeah. Carolina blue kicks, hottest nigga on your block. I ain't Jay, I ride up, but the wolves coming from my spot. Turn up a percentage of youngest winning without no college. I'm in my ladies with nothing, JV about this ballin'. I lost my deal, got one wheel, he seen a nigga genius. My rapper skills is on Chapel Hill, with you ain't see it. I love, Pyro, Ray Swisher, my vibes on. My opposition declined slow. My J straight out of China, like baby Cairo. Shout out to Tiger, but my squad, Balenciaga. One of the rare, some fly Snickers, the rep the chocolate. It was all a dream, it was all a dream. Never Michael Jeffrey in 17s, I'm staying with my team. No bullshit, loyalty rare. Don't worry about it, Charlie. Yeah, yeah. So it's on me. I got threes for the whole team. Uh, now we got the shot, MJ. 88, now ain't never coming down. Right? So what's on me? I caught threes for the whole team. Now we at the top. 88, now ain't never coming down. Right? Like for me, I don't do stuff for attention, but I think if, if, if the word gets out there and inspires somebody else to do it, then we're, we're helping everybody and that's what it's all about. I remember being these kids age, and they don't know it right now, but these memories are going to last a lifetime. For me, that's what it's all about. Again, it's been awesome here, you know, especially being in the inner city where I grew up, right down the street, Rainer Beach, uh, being here. One of the best high school teams, best high school uh, programs in the country. Uh, very proud of that. So for me, it's, it's always been a blessing. It's always been easy for me to come down and show my face because it may, I'm, I'm a part of the community. Man, he can't be doing James Brown. He can't James Brown and Jimmy Ward travel. They got momentum right now. We gotta stop it. watching your clip. They got momentum. We gotta stop it right now. So I'm always be here whenever Maul needs me. Uh, you know, Rainier Beach 206. Man, we hold it down. We bond together as a unit, man. The drag, if you want to turn it into a hazel, you can, okay? It can either be drag straight shot or drag hesitation. It's your choice. The higher you elevate, the more they start scouting you. So you got to have a counter for it. Then you, when you get really good, you got to have a counter to the counter. So he's showing you guys counter. It's all progression. So you got to communicate. It's, they got an advantage, so you guys got to talk even more so, right? Cover for each other. You got to use energy in your voice. Eric, 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 I see him. I'm on top. Four, 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 five, get there. Oh, oh, man. Push it up, push it up, watch up! Keep your rhythm, 
Keep your rhythm. Let's go. Next up, next up, next up. Next up, man. Let's do it. Neutral position. I should be able to put a board across your back. And it should be able to balance. You have one minute. Off your knees. The best players are in the best shape. Of course, it's my open step. I'm open. Closeout's coming. We're ripping. One belt and score. To the right wing, we'll probably have eight kids at each basket. Get there, go. As a shooter, you know the pass is coming from here. Start breaking down, getting ready. Get your hands ready. I want the ball. Don't wait like, oh, okay. Mess me. This can mess up my shot. I gotta be ready. Everybody get down and ready. Get downhill, this man has to go. That's what he's doing. All of your music is sting, son Four hundred four with your thing, son I put the pen to the paper That is the end of you haters I don't need y'all, that's the end of you haters Maul Crawford, Elite 30 No, my team's winning My team's about to win You know, this is what I do, Coach Carter 2.0 Hey, I'm the real Coach Carter This is the original, that's 2.0 He's about to go down you know. Pushing it out like I've been to you greatest I'm taking it global, you never can say this Looks like a stealth, you need better surveillance Put us in the net, you should net us with payments Red us, debate us, the best with the cadence Pushing myself and obsessing for greatness Like, what? Hey. Losing my mind, I'm confessing insane It's like, what? Hey. Like, I told y'all I had that in my bag. That's a bag. I ain't even a Gucci bag. That's just a duffel. Uh, this Jamal Crawford camp is a great learning experience because he's one of my favorite players. Jamal doesn't just bring one one guy like with one attribute. He brings all different type of dudes that's been there that's helped him get to where he's at. A uh, big thing I'm learning is patience. Um, you know, get on the floor for a loose ball, get up, take your time with it, read the D, um, and then make your move. Um, just don't rush your shot, don't rush, don't rush your moves. Uh, go game speed, but, but be patient with it at the same time. And I learned how to be patient while using the screens and playing with my teammates. You know, just be a good guy, uh, be humble, um, always give back to the community, uh, just like he's doing. Uh, big thing for me is consistency. On offense, you know, getting to the cup when I want. Um, obviously, knocking down my shot. That's always been my thing, you know, being a knockdown shooter. Um, and, and be a leader, uh, be a better leader, uh, be more vocal. I wanted to be a leader and show a lot of energy. Um, the drill is just to uh, be patient, don't rush like you're shy once you like come off a screen or something and like follow through. My signature move is like the behind the back. I like it the most though, in that crossover. My specialty, uh, I lead people and my counter move is my behind the back, so that's probably my specialty move. That's how I get past everybody, it doesn't really matter who it is. His, his signature move, the shake and bake, where you go behind the back twice and hit him with the layup, that's probably one of my favorite moves I love to do. And the things I liked about the Jamal Coffee camp that we put a lot of work into our dribbling and our hustle and our energy in our leadership. Uh, probably my goal for this year is to win a state championship with Cleveland High School. Gatorade player. You know, trying to have a big time year for my, my last year in high school. Mr. Basketball, state champ. Uh, you know, when I average 25 and 10, you know, be the guy. Basically be first in everything. And, and try to get a Gatorade Player of the Year in the state. I just want to say thank you to Jamal Crawford. It's a blessing having somebody to come in. For him helping in the community and giving back. It's really, it's really a blessing for him to give to us. I really appreciate Jamal throwing his camp for us. He speaks upon everything, nutrition, um, weights. Um, it's not just about basketball, really. It's about taking care of your body. And yeah, it was a lot of fun. See all my homies and stuff. Play basketball, one of my favorite sports. Him coming back, talking to us, giving us tips to get where he's at is just nothing but blessing. And I'm just grateful for him to come back and give me tips because I'm trying to be where he's at right now.
he's not like a celebrity to us. He's like a just like a big homie who has, like he said yesterday, a lot of money. So that's not what we look at him for. We look at him as somebody who cares, somebody who's here to help. It's very special. Because Jamal breathes, sleeps, and eats basketball. That's what he does. I mean, it was his first love before anything else. I like the drill that he's been giving us because in the NBA, you know, it's like change of speed, um, off the ball, cuts, and stuff like that. So it's not really just one-on-one -on -one situations. It's like, how are you going to score without it? You know, I got really close to him, working out with him the whole summer, um, talking to him a lot, picking his brain. Um, really, I've been always been a slasher all my life, and I've just been trying to improve my range. I'm great for mid-range, and now I can shoot the three very well. I'm just trying to make that more consistent. This camp is awesome. I went to all the camps, and it's fun. I like that, how we had to give a shoes for a community give back. You get to see actually a real basketball player, and not a lot of kids can um, be able to have that opportunity. They play basketball good, they have good games. There's no slacking, you gotta work hard 24-7. It's different because there's more coaches and like more people that I know around me helping me out. You know, good for guys to go against each other and see who's the best, see who's really, who's really top 30. One of the best camps in the country, kids working hard, getting it in. Top 30. Shout out to JC, you know, that's my big bro. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to Ada, we here. Those who make it, those who go to college, whatever, just make sure you guys give back. Make yeah. sure you guys give back. This, this is be, important, this, this is important, y'all. Yeah. This, 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 this is how it starts. This is gonna be, there's gonna be somebody younger than you who's gonna be really good, is gonna need guidance. We're gonna need to know the knowledge that you guys know. Just pay it forward. That's all, I don't want nothing from you guys but to do that. The next generation is a fifth grader right now who's really good. You know what I mean? Or maybe he's not good now, but he's working towards it. He cares about basketball or whatever he cares about. Just pay it for it. Look out for him. It's never just about you. You know what I mean? Like, it's never just about you. It's about your team. I played here, like I said, 98, and they still talk about our championship team back then. I didn't care. I don't even remember what I had in the championship game. It didn't matter. I just missed it, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, not a bad good. friend. Man. It's good. It's yeah, good. Enough. Thank you. Thank you so much. And this is my favorite camp by far. Like, to see these guys come up and just get the knowledge that I got now. I wish I got somebody to do that thing. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. from, from eating right to everything. Acting like right. Stretching, acting right. You know what I mean? Like, everything. Absolutely. With all the distractions that's going on right now, too, man, it's good to have this. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But it's going to be, this is my first camp like this. And especially to me, this group will always be special to me. So, yeah, you guys see. It's good to meet y'all, man. I hope y'all stay out of trouble, man, and work hard, man. He you knows how to make it out here these days, man. Yeah, tell him about the journey, how it, no matter what, it ain't never gonna be easy. <laughs> it it, it, it ain't something. never gonna be easy and it's never gonna stop. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, a lot of people see, all that they see what happens on Instagram or when, or they only see the, the, the championships. They don't see the injuries or the, the, the not getting along with teammates and coaches and, you know, all the things that, all the variables that can happen in this business, you know? So y'all yeah. keep your head on straight, man. Y'all gonna go far, man. There's a lot of good basketball in this city, man. For sure. And he's, he's like family, away from family. You know what I mean? Like he's he's entrenched and he's as genuine as I've ever seen. So y'all know. Y'all know what it is. The grand scheme of things, you know, it's my last shit. Ball loose. Scorpio freaks, quantity Gemini. 